we can see an, uh, an explosion of light uh, from 1992 up until today, especially in China, but also in South Korea, Taiwan and Japan. In the case of North Korea, where we have no lights, we can't rely on nighttime lights. Instead, we need to look at satellite-based land cover data. And what we can see is an expansion of agricultural land. Uh, what would be normal in a modern agriculture uh, area would be an intensification of agricultural land. Here we can see that forests, forests are turned into um, croplands. By using land cover data from uh, satellite images, we're able to identify pockets of growth in the agricultural production. We were quite surprised to identify these pockets of development. With the collapse of Soviet Union, North Korea did not get the um, aid in terms of fertilizers that was absolutely crucial for production of agricultural goods. So with the collapse of Soviet Union, North Korea had to change its way of achieving growth in the agricultural sector from using fertilizers, fertilizers to expand the area of agricultural land. And that is what we can observe in our analysis. The level of, the level of development is rather small, um, but with our methods we can highlight the areas where we can see this small development.